So you want to take your first set of phyllo dough and wipe it lightly with clarified butter. In my case, I used the ghee from Trader Joe's, which is a nice little shortcut. So you just want to wipe it kind of lightly. Um, sometimes the blotting technique can work pretty well. And then you take the second square and you want to offset the corners. And it doesn't matter if it's, if it's not perfect. Um, but just lightly press that down and then wipe that, um, brush that layer with the melted butter as well. Um, and you're going to do this with each sheet. And then you want to take the other one. And this one doesn't have to be quite as perfect, but you're kind of trying to create a sort of a star shape, um, which will make nice a nice parcel at the, at the end that isn't too uh, symmetrical. So block that one as well. And then you want to take about two tablespoons of your filling, which is uh, room temperature. And then once you have your filling in there, you can kind of press it down so it's a little bit more compact. And then take two opposite corners and then just start kind of pleating, pulling in each side. And it doesn't have to be perfect, but try to fold it so you kind of have pleated on all sides. And it should come together pretty quickly and it will hold. And then you just want to lightly brush the top with a little bit more of the butter. And then you have your little parcel and it's ready to go into the oven.